What's up everybody, it's Suki here. Do I have pit stains? Oh, that's tragic. Welcome to my apartment. Yep, that's right. Today's an exciting day because I'm launching a brand new web series. So every Monday, right here on the Suki YouTube channel, you are going to be watching this video. So it's a video called Unspoken, where I talk about things that people usually don't speak about because they're either embarrassed, they're ashamed, or you know what? They're just downright shy. I'm going to pull you out of that shell and speak about the things that you don't want to speak about. Now, sometimes this video may get a little bit awkward because I'm breaking the reality of life. But listen, from me to you, I've been through some things. You've been through some things, and together, we'll share our experiences and talk about them here. So, let's begin. The first topic that we're going to talk about is acne. Let's face it, there's nothing like getting that pimple on your face for the first time. Oh, no. I had full-fledged acne last year from, like, I want to say June to about now, essentially. I think it's very important that you guys should know that these things, for it to all go away, it takes time, and although it's there right now, it, you still should find ways to love yourself because everybody should love themselves. Hey, Suki. Hi. I love you. I love you too. So this is the story. Randomly, last summer, I was crazy. I was hosting and shooting and dancing and rapping and all of a sudden I broke out with the worst acne a man has ever seen. It was so weird. I didn't have acne in all of high school. I would like get like little pimples, pimples and all of a sudden it was just like everywhere. It was like in my eyebrows, all here, all there. Actually wait, I have pictures that you need to see right now. Look. So I tried Accutane, didn't like it, it wasn't for me. The doctor was very like, you need to do it, this is what will clear it up, and if you get off of it, it'll all come back. And I was just kinda like, I just don't like the idea of putting these like prescription drugs in my, in my body for six months. If it's for you, you, you do you. But it wasn't for me. Went to a naturopath and said, because maybe it was my diet, because everyone's like, it's what you put in your body. And I'm like, you don't know about me or anything I do. Nice try. She told me to just cut out dairy and eggs. Everything has dairy and eggs in it. So I tried it for three months and it all went away. And the worst part about having the full face of acne was being around all these people who just had flawless skin. Yeah, I just have like this like little pimple here. <gasps> what you talking about? You have flawless skin. What? So what I want to do is I want to give you some tips of how to either maintain, get rid of, or help your acne. Are you ready? I'm ready. Let's go. Number one, don't pick your pimples. I know you see them, and you're like, if I pick it, it'll probably come off of my face. No, you're gonna get like deep-rooted pot scars, and I think I might have some actually. See, I have a pimple right there. If you look closely, you can kind of see some scarring. But. They heal. They heal over time. Eventually they go away and it sucks for now, but... Number two, if you have oily skin or acne prone skin like I do, I use like a salicylic acid wash that just... It's good because it dries up your face because it has so many excess oils. So you want to just like use it and wash your face twice a day. Never ever skip. Okay? Sorry, that was disgusting. Number three, remember what you put in your body will come out of your body. And I'm not talking about poo, because you're thinking it, but I said it. Just treat your body well. Heal your stomach, eat lots of fruits and, fruits and vegetables. I know it sucks, but if it's for your face, it's for your face, because you know what they say, you can't keep up with my pace. But remember, no matter what, it is not gonna go away all of a sudden. Like it takes months and months and months and months. And by the end of it, you're gonna be saying, I got 99 problems, but I can eat one of them. Hit me! Know what I'm saying, guys? Nobody knows what I'm saying ever. Maybe it's because I talk too fast. This is gonna be a thing that I do every week, so make sure you subscribe, you like, you comment below, and I'll for sure respond to you guys, and uh, let me know other topics you want me to talk about too, because as I said, 
I've been through some things. See you guys soon. Peace.